Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, using string tokenizer how to split the string into uh, multiple tokens. Uh, to explain this, I have created this sample program. First, I will run this program, then I will explain. So, it is asking uh, if you want to return uh, delimiter as a token, then enter true, else enter false. So, I will enter uh, true. So, this output uh, we got. So here uh, inside main method what I am doing is uh, uh, I am creating a scanner object and uh, getting a, a boolean value from the console. Then uh, that boolean value I am assigning to uh, return uh, delimits. Okay. And uh, this is uh, a string value which uh, I want to split into uh, multiple tokens. And uh, delimiter is and symbol and I am creating a string tokenizer object and I am using a constructor uh, here which accept uh, string value delimiter and uh, return delimits this is a boolean value so here I enter true so uh, delimiter also return as part of the token ok uh, then I am uh, displaying uh, total number of uh, tokens uh, here you can see and total number of token is uh, 7 then uh, I am looping uh, string tokenizer and uh, getting each token and displaying the uh, tokens ok so here you can see token 1 Peter token 2 and token 3 is token 4 and token 5 playing token 6 and token 7 football ok so, because uh, uh, we specified uh, return delimiter as uh, true, so the delimiter also considered as a token. Okay. I will run again and uh, this time I will give false. And if you see the output now, uh, the delimiter is not considered as token. So, total uh, token count is 4 and here you can see uh, four tokens token one uh, peter token two is token three uh, playing token four uh, football okay uh, because we entered uh, uh, return delimiter as uh, false uh, so and symbol uh, won't be considered as a token okay and uh, this is about using string tokenizer how to split a string into tokens and uh, thanks for watching bye